I am Dr. Bhuvan Dhabar, Medical Oncologist, Director of Medical Oncology at Fortis Hospital, Mulun, Mumbai. At Fortis Hospital, we cater to a large section of oncology patients. Oncology here, we cater to approximately 30 patients in OPD each day, especially three days a week when we see more than 30 patients in the outpatient department. We have a very, very excellent functioning outpatient department as a daycare, where we have got at least three to five trained chemotherapy nurses, where all routine procedures of chemotherapy are taken care of, right from central line to taking care of the port, bone marrow test, everything has been done in our daycare. We have a very good functioning department in the sense we have got all the three modalities of treatment here. We have excellent radiation oncology department, where we cater to SBRT and different forms of radiation. We have senior surgical oncologists who takes care of the surgical part of it. And we as a medical oncologist are working here where we cater to most of the systemic forms of treatment that we have. For example, as you all know, we have chemotherapy, we have immunotherapy, we have hormonal therapy and we have targeted therapies. All these four forms of treatment are very routinely given here. We cater to approximately 20 to 25 patients in the daycare every day from Monday to Saturday. And with that, our nurses are exceptionally well trained how to take care of these patients. We can cater to all emergencies. We have got an excellent ICCU where we have got senior intensivists to take care of our patients. Most of our patients do not require ICU, but we have everything possible to take care of them. Immunotherapy is regularly being used. In my experience, I have given immunotherapy even to a 92-year-old patient who tolerated so well. So we have got most of the things under one roof. In the outpatient department, we cater to most of the patients who are on newer hormonal therapies like CDK4-6 inhibitors, which we use very frequently here. Immunotherapy is all given in daycare, as you all know. It's just a one-hour drip that our patient takes and goes home exceptionally well tolerated in whatever we have seen in our population. Chemotherapy is also given in the daycare. We have an excellent admission facilities where our, if a patient is say more than two to three days, we admit the patient. We have central venous access procedures done routinely. We have, we insert Hickman port. We have a pick line specialist who puts the patient. We do other forms of local regional therapies like taste, tear, Everything is being done under one roof. So you name it and we can do it. We have a bone marrow transplant unit also for our hemato-oncology patients. And we are going to start very soon CAR T cells also. For our difficult cases or what we call as rare tumors, we have a tumor board where we discuss with our radiation oncologist colleague and our surgical oncology colleagues how the best way to go ahead. Because many times, as you all know in oncology, it's a multi-modality treatment. It's not a treatment that is given by one person at all. It's a team that works for it. So, under one roof, right from routine to most of the complicated cases, two rare tumors can be taken, taken care of. So, this is, I would say, is a one-stop for all patients in oncology. Thank you very much.